Good morning, family. I want to thank God. I want to thank King Jesus. I want to thank the Holy Spirit and the angels for another day, another opportunity to be here with you to spread love, peace, joy, truth, and hope to all who are watching. Praise God. Well, family, you know, there's a lot of people out there or out here that don't believe, you know, that Jesus is God's son. He's the light of the world and he's the way. And uh, but what if you're wrong? You know, you, you do. You really want to take that chance and, and spend an everlasting life or, or not being able to spend, you know, salvation and 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 your afterlife, you know, with him in love in, in heaven, you know, in paradise uh, and. Or, or are you going to, you know, not be there, you know, because I only know what heaven is, you know, I, I don't know much about hell or, or, but all I know is being away from God, you know, is hell, you know, we could go through hell here or, or heaven here on earth. So, you know, being with God is, is heaven uh, because he'll get us through anything, you know, when the world and people and everything else lets you down, uh, God won't, King Jesus won't, Holy Spirit won't, and the angels won't. So, you know, why turn that down? You know, but a lot of people, unfortunately, will. But, uh, you know, if you still got breath in your body, you still got a chance to catch that ride when Jesus come back. Because you don't want to be one of those ones that's looking up going, I missed my ride. Because you won't get another chance. So, you know, if you're watching this, you still got a chance, you know. Give God a chance. Give Jesus a chance. Give the Holy Spirit a chance. Give the angels a chance to show them. You know, don't let your, your mind and your ego make a decision for you that etern that, that that depends on your eternity because there is more life than, than what's here in this physical form and and when you uh, go within you know prayer meditating you know reading God's words giving God a chance you know because I'm sure you know we all have spiritual experiences when you had that near miss in the car in an accident that was God you know when uh, you thought about someone and they called that's God you know a lot of people don't pay attention, you know, to the little things, uh, you know, when God is working in their lives, you know. So and, and, and when you turn to him, you know, you can see the little things and the big things and let God wow you because he's wowed me and he's wowed a lot of his children. And with King Jesus, it's the way. So, you know, don't don't miss that ride with King Jesus. But anyway, this is what I was led to today. This is John uh, one. I'm starting here at 16. From his abundance, we have all received one gracious blessing after another. Hey, if you're, if you're uh, living and watching this, you know, you're blessed because God gave you life. Satan didn't give you life. Uh, God, uh, love, you know, creates. Fear destroys. So you wasn't created by Satan. You were created by God because only light and love, only God creates. Only love creates. Like I say, fear destroys. And, and, and a lot of us, you know, a lot of people are letting Satan, you know, destroy them. But you, you can put a stop to that. You can accept King Jesus and have everlasting life. Praise God. For the law was given through Moses, but God unfailing love and faithfulness came through Jesus Christ. Unfailing love, unconditional love. You know, that's one reason I'm here. You know, I know who I am and I'm loved. And God showed me that, you know, I experienced that. So, you know. Uh, no matter what people do to me, I'm still gonna love them. But you know, uh, I'm I'm not a, I'm not a fool. You know, if God tells me to fight, I'm gonna fight. But if He tells me to stand back, I know He's gonna fight. You know, so have heck, make sure you got that coverage. You know, and because God fights for us all, whether we know it or not. Praise God. And one way that He's fought for us was with King Jesus. Jesus died for us. So all the stuff that you've done wrong, Jesus got it covered. Jesus covered it all. He He did a perfect job. So no matter what, what sin you've done, Jesus has that covered. All you have to do is accept him and ask for forgiveness. And it's like you've never done it in God's eyes. Praise God. God knows what he's doing, y'all. We don't, but God does. Praise God. No one has ever seen God but, but the unique one who is himself God. Jesus is, is God in human form, you know. And I didn't realize that until, you know, a few years ago, you know, because I'm still learning and growing. So, you know, let God, let God grow you. Don't let Satan, you know, destroy you. Let God grow you. Praise God. But the unique one who is himself God is near to the Father's heart. He has revealed God to us. So, you know, when you accept King Jesus and you follow Jesus' way, you'll see God. Praise God. This is the uh, synopsis. The true light of the world became a human being known to us as Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus who was full of God's unfailing love and faithfulness. 
You know, I, I, you know, when I had the out of body experiences, I had two more experiences. You know, during meditation during that time. Uh, you know, when I when I was praying and meditating, and then and God took me out my body, and and I experienced, uh, I experienced love that I didn't know we could experience. I experienced a knowledge that God showed me a knowledge, and and I experienced omnipresent. I was everywhere at once. And then another uh, time during meditation, I experienced King Jesus. It was a light that enveloped me, and it was just as powerful as the first one. And then I experienced another uh, experience of when uh, I was during meditation, and and it was like uh, I was wearing a, a bone and meat coat, and it was holding my spirit down, and it was just as just as uh, powerful as as the other two. So you know, I, and that was the Trinity. You know, God took me out of my body. Jesus came as the light, and the Holy Spirit was showing me the 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 the, the struggle of, of being in this in this physical form, holding our spirit down. But but when we turn to God, you know, he'll he'll lift us up. You know, he'll get us through anything because man's going to let you down whether they want to or not. But, you know, we're all fallible, but God's not. So, you know, turn to God. Let God show you what he can do. Praise God. Uh, through Jesus, who was both fully God and fully human, we can know what God is like and enjoy a relationship with him. It's all about that relationship, y'all. You can't get a better relationship than with God because then, you know, you get everlasting life. You get power. You get love. You get and, and you can you can uh, help heal other people, you know, because Satan want to use you to hurt people. But, you know, that's a, that's a that's a dead end street. When you when you roll with God, that, that street don't ever end. Praise God. Jesus Christ came to bring us God unfailing love and forgiveness and to reveal God's faithfulness to us. God's forgiving, forgiving grace says, I forgive you for your wrongs. I will accept you freely for the person you are his faithfulness says i will follow through on all i have promised so you know with god we get forgiveness but with satan you don't you know you roll with that ego and the ego don't forgive the ego you know gonna trample you down and, and 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 just try to you know destroy you so you know when when you're about when you're being destroyed by other people just know you know it's, it's not really them it's the, it's the uh satan working through them you know, because I've allowed him to work through me, but I'm, I'm a lot better at, at allowing God to work through me. So, you know, we have a choice whether to to be an uh, agent or uh, or or used by God or used by Satan. Choose to be used by God to catch that ride when Jesus comes back. I love me some Jesus. Turn to Jesus. Let Jesus show you what he can do in your life, because, you know, like I say, a lot of teachings around don't don't teach you to have a personal relationship with God. And when you have a personal with God, you know, King Jesus comes along with that. So, you know. Except King Jesus, so you won't miss that ride when he comes back. But anyway, that's all I have today, family. Let love reign in your life. There's no relationship greater than the one with our loving and glorious creator. I love you. God bless you. Thank you for watching and have a very, very blessed day. Bye.